morning guys. We have arrived in Greece. We're at Dioscope. It's my second time here, but it's Matt's first time. We just got breakfast on our balcony and it's beautiful. So we're here for a family holiday. Let's kick it off. like the second hour of the trip and I'm already in my second bikini we're going for watermelon I've got no makeup on because I don't know if I feel like putting any on today I have fake tan on I have sienna as the under base and I put some James Reed coconut oil over as well this view is just breathtaking so I came here a few years ago with the girls and now I am back with my family. Oh my god, I can see paddle boarding. I am so excited. Paddle boarding is my favourite. So we just had an amazing breakfast um, and then we're going to go down and see everyone at the beach. I'm just going to give you a quick room tour. So you've got a bathroom. Bath. This is where all my beauty stuff is. Here's the bikini. So yeah, I've got my Neutrogena. Cordley, James Reed, Flower Bomb Oil, Copacabana Bronze Glow Oil by Solgenaria for all my lipsticks, Tilbury Mac, Armani Fresh, my sun creams, La Roche, Vici, Pis Buen, and my Nux Oil, Bronze Goddess, all the skincare, Elemis, Elemis, tampons. So you can kind of like see the bathroom is nice and big. And then you walk through here, you've got a big comfy bed, mirror, mat, oh hey, my beach bag, which is so cute. And then we walk through here, and this is the view. Oh yeah. I'm wearing this cute little dress. We're gonna go have a walk down to the beach. How cute is this? I had a nap down by the beach. Now I don't know who I am or where I am. Hair on top, the head and a pineapple. It's my happiest moment. I love this dress. It's very, very cute. We are just gonna go in our little pool now because it's just so perfect. Then I think we might go to the gym. I haven't spoken much today because I feel like today has been the first day of my life in the last like five years. I've just taken a day off and it's been really chilled. I napped, I read a book. I feel good. I ate lots of satsuki and pita and chips. Also had a fight with some wasps. Let's swim. Jumpsuit. Oh my god, it's very see-through, but I can't really be bothered to get out of it. Do you think this is too see-through? looks very see-through on camera. I haven't washed my hair. I used Victor from Rolf Flower Bomb Body Oil. I'm wearing a MAC lipstick in shade Habanero. And I've actually not got foundation on for once. I'm wearing sheer brilliant soft lifting tint by Decorte, which is really good. I'm very impressed with this. Ready for dinner? Yep. Let's go. Yeah, girl, you're so overwhelming. You're like a song to 
Guys, this little dessert is the nicest thing ever. Praline, praline, however you pronounce it, it's like crunchy chocolate piece of heaven. Morning guys! You know when you're actually really tired and your body's not used to sleeping and doing nothing so you actually feel more tired? That's me right now. Swimming costume of the day! Um, we're just gonna go get some breakfast before breakfast finishes because we are very late getting up. He got his nails through the thing. <laughs> it's only a dress. <laughs> oh, he's snuggling with it. Don't worry. <laughs> but he's actually got his nails in it though. <laughs> he's pierced his nails through it. Goodbye, dress. Now you're not fighting with my dress. You've been nice, aren't you? Club sandwich for lunch. So at this resort, everyone gets buggies everywhere. I am out of breath. And we've chosen to walk because on the way down, it's only like 10 minutes. On the way up, oh, is that a cricket making that noise? Oh my god, that's so loud. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, it's so steep. I don't actually think you can tell on camera. But it's really steep. For some weird reason, Matt said he won't do sprints with me up them. Did you guys even hear a word of that? Stuck in a windstorm, very windy. Look at my hair. I've not been putting much makeup on. I actually don't have anything on now. It feels great. I don't really like to sit outside and sweat with makeup on. Oh, just showing you my legs. Um, this is, I've got the bikini like hidden down, but this is like a little beachy dress, which is really cute and I will link everything below. We're just gonna go and chill outside in our pool. Can you see? Um, because as beautiful as it is downstairs, when you have an amazing pool in your room, you kind of wanna just chill in your pool, in your pool. but I wanted to just show you this dress. So we got a big pizza slice. Look at this. <gasps> this is meant to be a non-working holiday and I've spent like the last four hours working. Anyway, laptop is shut. I wanna show you what I got from World Duty Free. I used their click and collect part of the website, which is so, so, so good. But I have to run to dinner and I'm really late. So I'm gonna unbox that straight in the morning for you. I'm just gonna quickly get changed and then head to dinner. This is a big cake with like praline down the side, so we seared it so that we could just have the praline on top of the cake. So, 
So the boys have gone to get a good spot for football and me and my mum are having cocktails downstairs at the beach house. It, oh, you're actually going to go to My mum's wearing the jumpsuit that I actually have that I wore for vlogging awards. Love it. <laughs> Winning. So we're just having some cocktails. It's just like a new area of dance. So it wasn't here last time I came. Mum making herself at home, making herself all comfy. I like the shoes. They're really nice. Morning and guys, I need to wash my hair. I'm wearing this this morning. We just ran to breakfast because we were really late. The issue is, Love Island was on one hour late last night, meaning it was on midnight here last night. Meaning I stayed up and got really excited, meaning I'm very tired because we had to get up very early for breakfast. So we ran down to breakfast, ate lots of amazing food. The breakfast selection at Dios Cove is very, very good. And you can get it to your room as well. But because last night was such a rush because the football was on, we, I didn't have time to show you what I wanted to show you. So, where are we? I went through duty free as I always do when I flew this time. Well, duty free, hey. And I actually never ever fly from Leeds and Bradford really. And Leeds and Bradford doesn't have as big a world duty free section as a lot of the other airports just because it's a smaller airport. I had absolutely no idea but with World Duty Free, you can do a reserve and collect. Basically means that if there's something that you want that isn't available in another airport, so for example, you want a MAC lipstick, you know that it's in Gatwick and you know that it's on their website or you want some Dior sunglasses or you want a fragrance, you can literally go on their website on World Duty Free, go on reserve and collect, and then you can order it and you can order it to arrive on the day that you fly so you can go and pick it up from your local airport. It's so convenient, it's so handy and you even get like email reminders and notifications to say that your parcel's there. So basically when you head on the website, you click which country you're flying to and where you're flying from and all of that jazz, it's really easy. Dates that are circled in orange, you can order any item on the website. If they're not, you can only order stuff from your local store because you need to ensure that it's gonna be able to get from the warehouse in time. So I ordered the new Versace perfume, which I am really excited to show you. Dun, dun, dun. So I got Versace Pour Femme Dylan Blue, and this is just such a nice scent. They do a men's one as well. Let me get it out of the box so you can see how special this is. There's no payment until you actually pick up and get the parcel there and then. And I literally walked in, the till was quite busy. I told one of the staff members, oh, I have something to collect. And she asked for my name and brought it straight over to me. And there it was, I got to leave the airport. It was so easy. But look at this bottle, how perfect is this? I feel like it's very aggression. And it's just, oh, look at this. I absolutely love buying perfumes for my trips because then I feel like I can spray it throughout my whole trip and then it's almost like it captures the memories of my trip. It's really weird. I did this on my LA road trip and now every time I spray one of my perfumes it reminds me of that trip. So this is going to be my Grease perfume and I just think it's such a special one. So now I just need to get the other version for the boys as well but yeah I love this. So I'm going to be spritzing that every night. So now we have a very big pizza. We are gonna probably go down to the beach and the pool area. And yeah, I just love this outfit today. It's so nice, although probably a little bit too warm to wear it. Can we appreciate the fact that I'm wearing a coconut swimsuit whilst drinking coconut water? This is the live Look at that view, guys. That is just spectacular. Dios Cove is definitely, definitely my happy place. Do you think we should take the snorkel for everyone? Bought this snorkel. It's cool. It basically means that you can just whack it all over your face. I wish you guys were here so you could experience just how perfect and calming it is up here. What do I look like? A lollipop. Matt says I look like a lollipop. I just got changed. I'm wearing this swimming costume. What do I look like? Lollipop, ba da da da. You make my heart go flippity flop. And then I'm wearing this over the top. Hair on top of head, guys. This is real life. I am not that girl that looks hard on a beach. I am that girl that has a pineapple. I just wanted to show you the sun cream because I am living for this from Clinique. Because it's like a dry oil and you spray it and then it just sinks in. And then this one doesn't sink in, but it's good because it's La Roche and I like La Roche. is asleep again. This is a changing room and Thomas sleeps under it. Oh, you're so cute. We are gonna have 
a look at the room service menu. Where is it? Oh, it's here. What do we fancy? We're back in the room now, by the way. I had a nice little walk up the hill. I need to wash my hair. I wanna go in the pool with my pizza. A big piece of pizza. What are you gonna order? All of it. All of it. All of it. I've, had, I've had so many DMs about this bikini, by the way. It's very nice. Do you like it? That means my thing's no. <laughs> Rice. Just having a blast on my pizza. Um, I am now just gonna wash my hair because we're gonna. I think we're gonna, we're gonna go to the gym, aren't we? It's weird that I'm washing it before the gym, but it'll be fine. Um, so we need to take some pictures and stuff. I'm gonna put my hair feels like it's a bit dry. I'm gonna use this new mask from Lee Stafford Cactus Crush for mucho moisture. Ready for dinner, my hair. I've decided to keep it straight. This one ironing in his new trousers looking gorgeous. I'm gonna spray my Dylan Blue Versace scent. Capture those memories. Oh, it smells so good. Really nice. Oh, it smells like holidays. Kind of gently fruit, fruity, not like too fruity. Holidays, oh, I smell so good. So we're gonna go on a little wonder around the resort now. I wanna get a picture in this dress and I also have a bag of stuff with me to get pictures of. This is the re reality behind the gram. So it will be interesting to see if I actually end up wearing this one for dinner. I probably will because I really like this one. Palmer has been stood trying to get a nice picture and look, it's a little bit crazy down here. This is not nature. So I'm gonna get Matt to film the dress instead so you guys can see it and then we're gonna head down here for a drink. I was wearing this for breakfast, but I might get changed. I don't know, it's cute. I just feel like I just want it for breakfast and it's kind of tight. So we are just gonna go down, as we have been doing, and go to the beach area. But then I think we should go to the pool today to do something a little bit different. Let's go. And just like that, I'm going for this today. Time. Just realised that this dress is sold out, so I really hope it comes back in stock. Because I've had so many DMs about it today, so let's hope it comes back in stock. <laughs> One brother about to be delivered. Din din din. Express delivery. Bing! <laughs> Yeah, you probably should have shared them to be fair, lad. The boys' sandwiches were so big, they definitely, definitely could have shared. Matt in his element, 
snuggled up watching something on an iPad, but I don't know what he's watching. This is a book I bought, by the way, guys, to try and zen me out. It's actually quite good. I hope you can hear me with the wind, but this is like the main pool. I'm gonna go and show you the view. Only I could mess that up. Matt's figuring out. Oh, oh my god, don't tell me he's wanting to just pull out after all of that. <laughs> we did it. <laughs> I am ready for dinner. I got made to jump in the pool by the boys, so my hair is very wet, which is why <laughs> it's up. I'm wearing this dress, a little gown. I'm gonna spray my perfume before we head out for dinner. Guys, I always like to be real with you and Matt was just asking do I actually lie in my new bag. I'm sure you've seen it on this vlog but I don't really want to give it away because I've actually filmed a full unboxing video. So I don't want to ruin that too much. But Matt just said to me, so are you going to keep it? Do you like it then? Because you know you've got to like test drive it back. And I was like... Of course I'm keeping it, I love it. So I've even got two swimsuits and two bags and two dresses in there. And Matt was like, they're not gonna look good for pictures, are they? Because we're going to the beach to get some nice pictures. The problem is it's quite busy in the daytime, obviously. Other people use the beaches too. So I don't, I just get a bit nervous and embarrassed taking pictures in front of people, which is why I put them in my bag. I don't know, I'm sure you've spotted the bags throughout the video, but it's very nice. But please watch my unboxing video as well because I thought for people wanting like reviews and stuff, it would be good it's really hot still isn't it it's very very early very hot this is what you do when you've got hot wet ruined hair does anyone find that drying your hair abroad it's just not the same like when I dry my hair abroad I get holiday hair it feels dry yeah I even put I've been putting hair masks on everything and everything but it still feels dry so I'm just tying it up tie that up I mean Matt's got more hair than me you know. <laughs> you need to use one of my hair masks. I don't need it. You do? Your hair actually looks quite soft. Yeah, it's quite I feel like it's because I didn't wash it today and then I just tried to dry it and you need to like wash it properly and then it's soft. Right, we are walking down for dinner now. my high street haul oh, you'll know that this bikini was on it and I'm wearing it today we're we ready to go down to the beach so today is actually gonna be a bit more fun for you guys I think we're gonna hit the beach have some lunch and then me and Matt are actually gonna work out today and then we're gonna go into Agios Nicolaes we're gonna have a little date night and explore the local area it's really not like us to have explored some like to take this long to explore somewhere but we've actually just been chilling out Maxi and relaxed now cool what, what are the words chilling out Maxi and relaxed now cool not that though. That's on the words. Oops. Anyway guys, my skin was dry. 
Use my nukes last night. Feeling funky, fresh. Oh god, now they forgot to take the phone charger. Yes, that is my boy with my three sockets charged up. None of them are full though. None of them are so full. All of them are three quarters. Really? But they, I don't. I think these are broken because these were on charge. That one was on charge all night. Some of them are charged. Righty, let's go. By the way, guys, I'm wearing this now. Um, if you're wondering what's on my face, I do not have a single inch of foundation on. I've got a lip liner on. Hands up my small lips, people. This is MAC liner in so. But the reason I'm talking to you is because I've been using Elemis on my face as my sun cream. And then I put James Reed gradual tan drops on last night. Matt was asking what these are. You can't share them. And honestly, I don't know if this is the real sun because my face hasn't really been in the sun, so it's definitely not that. I have woken up this morning with a glow. Look at that. I look like I've got makeup on, don't I? Yeah. But it's not. You look dark, so I've got some less sun. <laughs> Helpful, but yeah, it's these James Reed Gradual Tan H2O Tan Drops. I haven't broken out, my skin is glowing. James, I love you! Okay, let's go. So in this hotel, you get funiculars down to the pool and the beach, which is great because my grandparents just can't walk and it's actually really handy for them. Me and Matt are currently having a competition to see which one comes first. Matt thinks that side, I think this side. No, it's your side. Yeah, my side's gonna come first, yeah. it's a bit dark, isn't it? Mission, get my grandma into the sea. Here she is. She's coming in the sea, yeah. Eating at like the beach club, I am wearing an avocado swimsuit. I'm trying not to get my nipples out for everyone, but you know, when you've got sun cream on, you're a bit sticky um, and you don't want to put the dress on and ruin it. Let's see. Monday oven baked feta cheese, what a dream! I have eaten so much tzatziki, I don't actually know if my stomach likes it. Wearing an avocado swimsuit. We're just about to go and get a pedalo for four of us so that Matt can do all the driving. Actually, I need some exercise, so I do not mind doing the driving. I just want a bottle of water to take with us. So we're gonna get one. <laughs> Like a, um, quite, a, quite a rocky, like, sea. Matt jumped in. <laughs> so we did what we always do. We came back and we chilled in the pool. It's just so heavenly here, you can't not. So I'm wearing this. I've got the swimming costume underneath because I want to go and get a picture in it. I love this dress so, so, so much. We are heading to Agios Nicolaus now. Really excited. I came here when I was a kid. Um, we're going to go and suss the situation out. Myself and Matt are going to have a cute date night and then my family are going to come and join us for drinks. <laughs> I just got myself a lucky Greek eye bracelet. So pretty. Oh my days, how nice is this? Oh my god, I literally love Agios Nikolai.
Oh, look at the dogs. They're so cute. Oh my God, that one's just having a little wash. We're just here, it's so beautiful. This is beautiful. Me and my brother used to collect all of these. They're so good. And my mum used to have those in the back garden. <gasps> Look how nice these are. Oh my God, I remember buying one of these puffer fish. Look, they're puffer fish. Have you seen them? Look how cool they are. <laughs> Matt, this literally looks like Venice. Yeah. I am so getting a picture stood at that bridge. Hi. No, thank you. So I bought myself a little bracelet with the eye on it. The reason I did that is because when I used to come to Greece and go to Turkey with my grandma when I was younger, she always used to buy the little eyes and we have them all around our house. Oh, those sandals are nice. We have them all around our house. We collect like all of these little shells and everything. I also really like buying from like independent stores when I'm abroad and it's something I actively try and do. I really like going up to someone and giving them 20 euros of my money to buy a bracelet. Whilst it might not seem a lot to us, to them, it's just like nice. And the guy was so lovely and was teaching me all about the bracelets. I'm half tempted to go back and buy my mum and my grandma matching ones as a little present as well. So we're just wandering around the little stores. It just brings back such nice memories of being a kid because this is kind of how I spent my, spent my childhood holidays wandering around these stores asking my mum to buy me things. We asked at the hotel where they recommended to eat and they said this place, I can't pronounce it, Blair Katsavrolika um, and it's beautiful, it's like a little garden although I'm way too hot in this dress I waited so long for it to come back in stock I'm so happy it came back in stock This little town, Agios Nikolaos, is so beautiful so me and Matt are going to have some cocktails and enjoy some Greek food That is a tower of zucchini, my loves A tower Oh my day Guys, I've had a sip of a cocktail and it's so strong that I'm already tipsy and like my heart's coming out of my chest. I'm just such a lightweight. Oh my god, it's Last night was amazing. It was so good to go to the local town. I'm just about to zap Matt. So yeah, you actually you think... Did zap yourself? No, you told me that you zapped yeah, I've your... Zapped it well, let's do it again, Matt. Yeah, I've zapped it. Mm -hmm. oh, wow. You see it? So how does that kill Fuck bug me. bites? Wow. Should we go for some breakfast then? Breakfast time. Yeah. Today's beach essentials, my 
favourite sandals? I've had so many questions about them. Vita Coco, a little hat, and back to my book. Also, sun cream today is this La Roche. This is my bracelet that I bought last night. Oh, it's the wrong way around. My bracelet from last night. My nails by Ragdoll Nails. Honestly, look how nice my bracelet is. Okay, so Love it. Too much to leave. I think to leave. Oh my goodness. And then my mum just comes over with Peter and Sassy. <laughs> Thank you. <gasps> Thank you. Oh, well, it either gets left and wasted or I know 200 people who love Peter and Sassy. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Thank you. It is always Satsuki o'clock. In my eyes, I've had a lot of Satsuki this week. I think I'm gonna turn into Satsuki, right? I'm gonna go into the sea now. It's lunchtime. What did we get? What did we get? I just whacked on a sports bra. So this afternoon has been so nice. The boys have been watching football. I have been watching football here. Can you see? I don't even, I can't even find the TV because England are playing. And my mum, I, and my grandma all sat with our feet in the pool, went on the pizza, and we had some lunch and like some fruit and stuff. And it was just really nice to spend time with my family. This trip has kind of all been about like family and just actually taking some time out and just enjoying time with the people I love the most. So family is so important. Like last year, my grandma broke his hip and we thought we were gonna lose him. And I never in my wildest dreams thought that he would be coming away with us again. And yeah, he's just, my family mean everything to me and I would do anything and give anything for them. So it's very special. So yeah, that's why I've been a bit quiet. Right, I'm just gonna quickly go and get ready for dinner and enjoy this view. And then I'm going to meet the boys down there at dinner. And just like that, she is ready for dinner. I'm wearing a MAC lipstick again. And I'm wearing this little dress. So let's go. I got changed because we're taking some pictures. I'm now back in this, which is my favorite outfit this trip, although I just can't get a nice picture in it. So we're just having, we just had a final dinner. We leave tomorrow at like 7 p.m. But I don't know if I'm gonna vlog tomorrow, like the full day, just because I think we're gonna be packing and stuff and checking out. So we're just having a one last night at the beach bar with the family. I popped some James Reed coconut oil on last night because we're heading straight to Wimbledon tomorrow. Like literally early hours of the morning so I wanted to make myself a little bit glowy without actually having to go in the sun. So we just got a breakfast delivery which was incredible. Let me show you this. So I'm going to eat this and then I'm going to love you and leave you because I think this vlog has already been way too long but I hope you have enjoyed it. Sorry I haven't done too much talking, it's been one of those kind of chilled weeks but I hope you guys have liked coming along and seeing the holiday with us. It's just been amazing to spend time with my family and I love how happy they are that they booked here so that makes me really happy. Dioscope is literally my happy place. We're already talking about how much we want to extend the stay so yeah. Don't forget to come say hi on Instagram and Twitter at mshalax. Lots of pictures of this trip on my, on my Instagram and thank you so much for watching as always. Big love. Bye.